Who could have predicted that 1969's Miss OSU would have such an important impact on agriculture in our state? Brenda graduated from Medford High School near her family's farm. Yes, my dad was a farmer and I've grown up on a farm and did all lines of work, rake hay, ride the tractor, haul the wheat. So I've been involved with agriculture my entire life. She received a bachelor's degree at OSU in business and a master's degree in business administration. And she met a young man who was also from Western Oklahoma, Raymond Sidwell. The two would marry in 1973. In 1980, after spending several years in Texas, Brenda and Ray moved back to a farm in northwestern Oklahoma, and Ray took a job with the OSU North Central Research Station. Because he had his doctorate in agronomy, he was chosen to be a senior superintendent. I saw that station improve over time uh, with his dedicated effort. Uh, to, to bring it up to a point where you know, it's, it's a top-notch research facility. That same year, Brenda started the Sidwell Insurance Agency. Her kitchen table was her office. So I had 25 customers my first year, and I began in my home. And from there, we expanded into a business in Goldtree, Oklahoma, where I'm presently housed in 1987 because, you know, you kind of outgrow your house. The couple raised two children, Bambi and Brady, who often helped dad at the experiment station. For Raymond, it was a dream come true. When I was really young, um, we, we didn't have any land to farm, so we rented a few places. So really, Oklahoma State was his, his passion, his driving force. Sadly, Ray would die of a heart attack two days before Christmas. He had gone to the research station to wrap Christmas gifts for his family. It was a great loss to his family in Oklahoma agriculture. But his legacy lives on, and the Sidwell family continues to succeed and flourish. Brenda's company is now one of the premier companies providing crop insurance for Oklahoma, Kansas, and Texas. Bambi and Brady both received their degrees from OSU and are deeply involved with agriculture. Before Raymond's passing, he and Brenda started the Raymond Sidwell Family Endowment for International Outreach and the Sidwell Family International Agriculture Scholarship Endowment Fund. In 2015, Brenda created the Dr. Raymond Sidwell Memorial Endowment Fund in plant and soil sciences in his honor. They take part in helping our students grow in their understanding of agriculture and in terms of risk management, insurance, and education. And working with the family, OSU rebuilt the research station that he loved, renaming it the Dr. Raymond Sidwell Research Facility. But really that family it has done a lot beyond the Lahoma Station. I mean, Brenda is a, a critical leader in uh, crop insurance and a you know, tremendous businesswoman, extremely successful. I'm so proud of my mom. I mean, obviously it has a lot to do with her hard work and dedication and, and just integrity and, and doing business and doing the right thing always. So I'm very humbled and very excited and, and um, want to give back to OSU what they've given to me. Brenda Sidwell, 2021 champion for OSU Agriculture.